Did any of your ancestors own a coat of arms? Find out at findmycoat.com. Hello everyone, it's John from findmycoat.com. And today we're gonna to talk about the Williams coat of arms. We're gonna go through six different coats of arms and the people and families that they belong to. First, we're gonna start with John Williams born around the year 1500 AD. He was made Baron Williams of Thame by Queen Mary Tudor in 1553. He was the master of the jewels and Lord President of the Council of the Welsh Marches, Marshes. His coat of arms was blazoned as follows. Azure, two organ pipes in South Tyre, the sinister surmounted of the Dexter between two crosses Pate in Pale Argent. His first wife was Elizabeth Bledlow, with whom he had three sons and two daughters. John Williams was a Welsh clergyman born in 1582 who served as the political advisor to King James I and was Lord Keeper of the Great Seal, as well as Bishop of Lincoln and Archbishop of York. He was once imprisoned in the Tower of London for committing perjury. His coat of arms is blazoned as follows. Quarterly, first and fourth, gules a chevron ermine between three Saracens' heads in profile cooped argent. Second and third, gules a chevron between three stags' heads e cabossed argent attired of the second. Next, we have John Williams, born in Northamptonshire, England, in 16, 1636. He became the chaplain to William and Mary after the Glorious Revolution and was consecrated Bishop of Chichester in 1696. His coat of arms was blazoned as follows. Sable, a dove argent, between three crosses, pate or... Next, we have the Williams of Vainall. The Williams Baronetcy of Vainall in the county of Carnarvon was created in the Baronetage of England on June 15, 1622 for William Williams. This family's coat of arms was blazoned as follows. Gules, a chevron ermine between three Saracens' heads cuped proper, the sixth baronet was represented he, the sixth baronet represented Carnarvonshire in the House of Commons, and on his death in 1696, the title became extinct. And here we have a picture of the actual hall that this branch of the Williams family lived in. Next, we have Sir Nicholas Williams, who served as High Sheriff of Carmarthenshire from 1697 till 1698. He was created a baronet on June 30th, 1706. He was a member of parliament and was Lord Lieutenant of that county from 1735 to 1740. His coat of arms was blazoned as follows. Argent, a lion rampant sable, paws and the end of the tail of the field. Crest, out of a mural crown proper, a demi-lion as in the arms. And here we see Edwinsford, the family seat. Lastly, we have Williams of Carehays and Scorier. The Williams family of Carehays, Burncoos, and Scorier were prominent owners of mines and smelting works for several generations during the Cornish Industrial Revolution. Their coat of arms was blazoned as follows. There, three crescents or Crest, a demi-eagle azure, wings elevated sable, each charged with a wing with four bizants. A branch of the family settled in Port Hope, Ontario, where they became well known and prominent. If you enjoyed this video and would like to learn more about your family and check if any of your ancestors had a coat of arms, please visit findmycoat.com. Thank you.